The FDA must decide now what to include in its next round of booster shots for COVID-19. An advisory panel recommended upgrading the shots to target an updated strain, as well as dropping the original strain from the formula. Kevin Cork explains the timeline for the change. The COVID-19 vaccines many are familiar with are on track for a recipe remix. I think what we're being asked is, do we think it should be updated for this fall? And, and I, I agree. The Food and Drug Administration's scientific advisors unanimously recommending Thursday that the next series of shots for the fall should be updated to only include protection against the newest variants. Updating the vaccine with the monovalent strain makes the most sense. I think the data is quite clear. The vaccines available today are formulated with the original coronavirus strain. And while they were reformulated to also include protection against earlier versions of the Omicron variant, that strain has also mutated with an Omicron subvariant known as XBB, now the dominant strain. And I think the Evidence is good that the, ex the currently circulating XPB is the correct strain to use. FDA advisors say the next shots should no longer contain the original COVID strain. Instead, health experts are eyeing which XBB sequence the updated vaccines should target. According to the CDC, the XBB 1.5 subvariant now accounts for roughly 40 percent of new COVID cases in the U.S. That was Kevin Cork reporting, and the FDA is expected to review the recommendation soon, and then the CDC, under new direction from Mandy Cohen, is scheduled to have its own advisory committee meeting next week.